Elon Musk has expressed surprising revelations about the moon, stating that it is not what we think it is. Despite numerous space missions being conducted to study its surface geology and properties, there are still many mysteries surrounding the moon. Scientists continue to work relentlessly to uncover its origin, internal structure, magnetic field, and other properties. Moreover, there is growing interest in utilizing the moon as a base for future space exploration and potentially colonization. NASA's Apollo program in the 1960s and 1970s remains a prominent mission, as astronauts successfully landed on the lunar surface during that time. The moon has been the focus of numerous missions conducted by various countries and space agencies. The lunar program, conducted by the Soviet Union between 1959 and 1976, included both orbiters and landers. The Apollo program, conducted by NASA between 1969 and 1972, successfully landed astronauts on the moon during six missions. NASA's Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter, LRO, launched in 2009, has provided detailed maps of the lunar surface and helped identify potential landing sites for future missions. In addition, NASA's Artemis program aims to return humans to the moon by 2024 with the goal of establishing a sustainable human presence on the lunar surface. China's Chang'e program, conducted by the China National Space Administration, CNSA, has also conducted unmanned lunar missions, including the Chang'e 4 mission which achieved the first soft landing on the far side of the moon in 2019. The space race between the United States and the Soviet Union began in the 20th century as a competition to develop greater spaceflight capabilities, stemming from their post-World War III nuclear arms competition and ballistic missile development. The space race, driven by national security concerns, led to significant advancements in space exploration. The competition between the United States and the Soviet Union began in the 1950s with both countries aiming to launch artificial satellites and achieve milestones in human spaceflight. The Soviet Union's launch of Sputnik 1 in 1957 and Yuri Gagarin's orbit around Earth in 1961 gave them early momentum. In response, US President John F. Kennedy set the goal of landing a man on the moon, which was achieved in 1969 with the Apollo 11 mission. While the US's moon landing was celebrated as a major accomplishment, some argue that the Soviet Union's first human spaceflight was equally significant. Both nations continued their efforts to explore space, with the US conducting robotic research on other celestial bodies and the Soviet Union focusing on space stations and missions to Venus and Mars. However, after the last moon landing, there was a significant pause in lunar visits. Recently, there has been a resurgence in interest in lunar exploration, with countries like the US, China and private companies investing resources into lunar missions. Elon Musk has made claims about Chinese scientists finding evidence of alien life on the moon, but these claims lack evidence and should be viewed with skepticism. If true, it would be a groundbreaking discovery that could change our understanding of life beyond Earth. The competition and rivalry in space exploration may limit transparency among nations, as each country seeks to gain an advantage. Nonetheless, the quest to uncover the mysteries of celestial bodies continues, driven by the desire for knowledge and scientific progress. Elon Musk recently made claims about Chinese scientists finding evidence of alien life on the moon. However, he has not provided any evidence to support his claims, and the Chinese government has not confirmed them. Musk has a keen interest in space exploration and has been working on developing the technology needed to transport humans to Mars through his company SpaceX. Musk believes that becoming a multi-planetary species is essential for the long-term survival of humanity. His plans for Mars colonization involve establishing a self-sustaining city on the planet. Many space agencies, including the United States, China and Russia, have increased their exploration efforts in recent years. China has made significant strides in space exploration and has uncovered a breakthrough material on the moon called Shengite. This material has been certified by the International Mineralogical Association. While Musk's claims about alien life on the moon should be viewed with skepticism, 
the mysteries of outer space continue to inspire exploration and capture the attention of humanity. Scientists made a remarkable find during the Chang'e 5 mission, discovering a unique lunar material called Shengite that has been certified by the International Mineralogical Association. This material is over a billion years old and has a composition unlike anything seen before. Additionally, traces of helium-3, a potential fuel source for clean and efficient energy, were found. Elon Musk leaked this information as he is a proponent of renewable energy and believes in the future of clean energy sources like solar and wind. The future of renewable energy looks promising, with improving efficiency, decreasing costs, and advancements in energy storage technology. These discoveries deepen our understanding of the Moon and pave the way for further exploration and utilization of lunar resources. The wide-scale deployment of renewable energy relies on battery technology to address the intermittent nature of sources like solar and wind power. Storing excess energy in batteries allows for a more reliable and economical use of renewable energy during times of high demand or when the sun isn't shining. Tesla has made significant advancements in battery technology, including their own long-lasting batteries and the Powerwall, a home battery storage system for solar energy. To sustainably meet our energy demands, we need to increase the number of solar cells, wind turbines, and battery storage units, as well as implement better regulations and incentives for renewable energy adoption. Elon Musk is driven by these goals and continues to push for a cleaner and more efficient energy future. Helium-3 has long been studied for its potential as a fuel source for nuclear fusion, a highly efficient form of energy production. Musk's decision to share information about Helium-3 highlights its transformative potential for our energy landscape. Unlike other elements used in fusion, Helium-3 produces less radiation and nuclear waste. While viable fusion reactors have not been developed yet, Helium-3 is believed to be more abundant on the Moon making it an enticing resource for future energy solutions. The discovery of a new helium-3 deposit by Chang'e 5 on the Moon has ignited a global competition to exploit the Moon's mineral resources, including helium-3. Aside from energy endeavors, Musk has plans to establish human settlements on the Moon, recognizing its potential for sustaining human life. Chang'e 5's exploration has also uncovered the presence of water on the lunar surface, challenging previous beliefs of the Moon's arid nature. Water is a vital resource for human survival and could greatly influence future lunar missions and the establishment of long-term human presence. These remarkable findings push the boundaries of space exploration and stimulate further scientific curiosity and exploration. Scientists discovered water on the Moon, challenging previous beliefs. China and NASA have ambitious lunar exploration plans including establishing a moon base and sending astronauts. Exciting discoveries continue to be made, such as the moon's molten core and evidence of its formation through a collision.